In this tutorial, we will look into the survey feature of DSLR Booth. Surveys allow you to collect data during the photo booth session by asking guests questions such as asking for their name, email, favorite superhero, or their feedback. You can add all kinds of survey questions in the settings menu. We'll start by clicking settings, then survey. Now we can get started with our first survey. Be sure to click the Enable Surveys button and then click Add Question. For this example, we will ask, what is your name? I'll make sure to select Short Answer in the dropdown and click the Required button. Next, we'll ask the guests what they thought of the event. We'll select Multiple Choice and add our answers. This question will be optional. If you want, you can also add a question asking for suggestions, email, or any other question. We'll add another question asking if they want to join our email list. You can also change the order of the questions by clicking the six dots. You're done! If we go through a session, you can now see how the question is asked after the guests take their photos and before they see their final print. We'll select the background. Get ready! So as you can see, it asks us for a name, so we're just going to put that in. Now it asks us what we think of the event, so we're going to say great. And we're going to say we don't want to join the mailing list, so we're just going to click next. Select an effect. And there we have Share it. Share your photos. We have the our picture, our print, that came up after we answered our questions. If we go back to settings and then survey, we can see a report of all of our survey answers. Just click view response. This will then open up our DSLR booth folder. And then we can open up the document to look at all our responses. Here you can see all of the questions and then all of the responses. Another great feature of using surveys is that you can incorporate your guests' answers on the final print. We'll start by looking at a pre-made example of how this works, and then I'll show you how to create it yourself. As you can see, my name and superpower appear on the final print on this superhero card. After you create the survey questions, as we've done earlier, we will need to add the answers to your template. First go to Template, then New, then add a name, and now we will make a basic template. First, we will click Image Data. I will place a Nexus signature, and then I will change the type down in Options to Survey Answer 1, as I want the name to appear here. I will also change the font so it looks like a signature. And there we go. The same process applies for all of the other questions. We just click Image Data, and then select the different survey question. Now that our superhero ID card is done, we can exit out of this. Get ready! We will enter our name, our superpower, so we will be saving the world. Our mode of transportation will be flying, and there we go. Now we have our signature, our transportation, and our superpower all in our own ID card. So uh, there you have it, a fun superhero ID card. It's just one of the many ways you can use the survey feature to make your photo booth better.